Problems with the digestive system. The following is a sample of conditions that may occur. Problems with the digestive system can be treated with a wide variety of cures, including antibiotics, other drugs, surgery, change in eating habits, etc. Some problems may be acute, where the symptoms appear suddenly and worsen quickly, or they may be chronic, where there is frequent and continual symptoms. Heartburn. Acid from the stomach goes into the esophagus and burns the cell. And acids are used to reduce the effects. Ulcers. Too little muchin in the stomach may allow hydrochloric acid to start dissolving the lining of the stomach. Some sources feel stress is a contributing factor. Diarrhea and constipation. See the large intestine. Notes. Vomiting. Conditions where a wave of peristalsis passes upwards. It's a reverse peristalsis. So your cardiac sphincter opens, the stomach contents are thrown up. Usually it's one symptom of a larger problem, such as food poisoning or flu. Appendicitis. You can see the large intestine. Inflammatory bowel disease. It's a set of conditions where sections of the intestines are infected with sores and bleed easily. Symptoms include abdominal pain, cramping, fatigue, diarrhea. It is diagnosed most frequently between the ages of 15 and 25 and 45 and 55. A common IBS would be Crohn's disease. It affects any part of the digestive tract from the mouth to the anus. Colitis, which infects the large intestine. And ileus, which affects is an infection of the ileum.